Hello there, I'm AJ Pothoferos, and welcome back to X4 Foundations in the Cradle of Humanity expansion, where we were, in the last episode, scanning these nav beacons, because uh, someone wanted us to scan the nav beacons to find a ship. Uh, and as such, we've got one more set of nav beacons to scan. Joy. Uh, they're also covered in... Um, in oh, uh, laser towers and uh, and mines, uh, and so we've been having to deal with the laser towers and mines as well, which is absolutely wonderful because it's always great to have to deal with all of the laser towers and the mines uh, when when you're scanning nav beacons. I just hope that they don't bother us so much this time. They're not going. They are going to bother us. It, I mean, it's just going to happen. Anyway, we've we've got some nav beacons ready for the next part of the mission, uh, and uh, and we should be ready for um, for being bothered by all this radioactive yuck soon as well. But I will save between then and actually doing stuff because obviously I don't want to get radioactive yucked. Right. That's. I don't know what's that. That doesn't look like a navigation beacon. Hmm. Don't know what that is. That's a thing, isn't it? Yes. Well, we'll get a little bit closer so that they all decide to attack us. Eh? Eh? Aren't, don't I look attackable yet? Surely I look attackable by now. Hmm? I mean, that mine's probably thinking about it by now. Well? Even the mine's not thinking about nav it. Beacon. Ah, there we go. There's the nav beacon. Great. They're all going to turn on me soon, and when they do that, mine's definitely going to turn on me. So I might as well destroy it now. If I, oops, that's the wrong. That's the nav beacon. <laughs> okay, there you go. There goes the mine. Brilliant. Uh, and then uh, I don't know if there's any more mines around here. Does it look like this one's got loads of mines? This Hello. This wreckage before you is what is left of your predecessor's ship. Hey. As you can you see, mean that bit? Not proficient enough to navigate this dangerous space. Yes. Needless to say, he was relieved of his duties after that incident and uh -huh. uh, sent to join a maintenance crew. Let's destroy all these. Let this be a cautionary tale, for you will need to avoid his mistakes if yes. you do not wish to share his fate. Deal. I think maybe I'm gonna die, aren't I? <laughs> okay. Destroy the laser tower! Good. I do not want that setting off whilst I'm in my spacesuit, and I know I'm getting in my spacesuit, so that's not happening. Die, laser towers! I'm surprised that these ones didn't turn on me like the others did. Okay, so we've got the nav beacon here. Oh, I'm actually going to be able to get to this. Is this the ship? No. What? Yes? Hey? What ship is this? <laughs> This isn't the ship. No, that looks like a wreck of a... I don't know what that is. <laughs> it's a wreck of a ship. That's what it is. Receiving beacon data. Great. Give me that beacon data. Now, why did he give me that information about the ship if... Very well. We know now what frequency she is looking for to find her way in. Uh-huh. What the heck was this ship? You should send her some calibrated nav beacons to uh, use as fixed points to navigate her way out of her misery. Uh huh. What the Push a nav beacon into the hazardous area so that your colleague can receive the signal. Lovely. Okay. Be aware so. That your nav beacons will probably suffer corrosion themselves, so uh -huh. it might take a few attempts. In that case, I could just use one of these, couldn't I? There's, there's no need for me to actually um, do anything. But that's been destroyed. I hope that's not the ship that we were supposed to be saving. Because if it is, it's very dead. <laughs> and they were saying, and he was saying like it was it was a ship that I'd actually um, got, wasn't it? Go, go navigation beacon, go. Why can't I go? Go, go, go. Oh, and, okay, I need to run up. All right, fair enough. Yeah, and then run. Shunt! Is that not a shunt enough? Right, for no, 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 shunt again. Shunt! Well? Ah! Okay, fine. It needs a bigger shunt, doesn't it? It needs a much bigger shunt. Unless that one's not going to do it, because it's the one, it's the, like the one from the mission. 
Maybe that's the way. Okay, what we'll do is we'll put another navigation beacon out. And we'll shunt that! Because apparently this one is no shunting. Alright, let's get back a bit first. Go, go, go! And then turn around and shunt. That's what we're going to do. Alright. I'm still surprised we've not found that ship. I so hope it isn't that destroyed ship because we need it for the mission. Alright. Okay, prepared. Let's dump a navigation beacon. Where are your navigation beacons? There you go, 20 of them. I had loads. And where is it? It's there! Nav oh, this one's got the same symbol on it as the other one, which means it's no difference. Oh, I don't get this. I don't get this at all. Ah, uh, okay. We're at one, one point something K away from it. We should be fine! Let's shunt it! Please do not miss the navigation beacon. Uh, is it taking it along with me? It is taking it along with me! Uh, no it's not. It's behind me. Okay. Is this working or not? No, this is working terribly, isn't it? You're actually going anywhere? No, you're not. You get stuck. You moving? Can't tell if it's moving or not. Are you moving? No? Yes? Yes? I'm not moving, so it's definitely moving. Not much. Not much at all. To be honest, it's about to stop. Just before the radiation. Wonderful. Okay. <laughs> you know what? I'm doing something else, which is to say getting up to good speed. And then, just dumping the satellite, right? And... Not satellite. Navigation beacon. What? What's last this? Order could not be completed. Danger. Well, shut up about the last order. I'm kind of in a dangerous position. Target acquired. Great. Quick, get out of that stuff. Oh, wow. <laughs> that was inconvenient. Nice of her to bother me in the middle of a mission. What was she doing anyway? Oh, she's gone. Where was she? She was in the void then. What were you doing? Ah, I know what you were doing. You were dumping satellites all over the universe. And you found that you ran out of them. Okay, fair enough. Uh, well, in that case, uh, forget all of those commands. Where are you with your stuff? Okay, remove all orders and commands. Yes, that's one. And then over here, and then dock, and grab all of the satellites. That's, that's what we're doing. Brilliant. Excellent, you do that. Great! Okay. Now she can stop bothering me. Alright, so where's that ship that it said that I was looking for? Let's have a look at the map. Look at us. And we have... Eh? Huh? What the heck? Oh, she's driven out of it. She has. She's driven out of it. We didn't have to worry about it. Oh, brilliant. Okay. This experiment was a thorough success. Good, he says. Ah, <laughs> the alloy composition protected the system's inside from any damage. Mm hmm. The minor navigational issues should not pose a problem once you join my assistant as pilot. Okay, yeah, I need to get right underneath this ship well, this time. Once you're ready, leave your ship somewhere safe and join my other assistant. Uh huh, somewhere safe. <laughs> Yeah. Wait a minute. Just planting this ship right underneath this thing. Right, let's see if we can go out and then we need to get to a position where we are right underneath it. It really does have to be right underneath it if I want to survive. Yeah. Bit further in. Bit further in. Last time it was an epic pain getting into this ship. An epic pain. I died about five times in the process. Oh, yeah. I don't think I've look at this ship. Oh, look. It's yeah, it's one of those. Uh, we know we know the ship quite well, don't we? Yep, we've had a few of these. Uh, we had the one that. Uh, um. There was one that was uh, sort of xenon xenon identified, uh, and that was was uh, that one was only a little bit earlier. Oh, look how close I've got. So that's brilliant. Okay, fair enough. Right, Danger. in that case... Hazardous region detected. What? Don't say that. 
You're not allowed to say that. I'm going to save just in case. Right. So we're all saved up and ready to plunge ourselves into the radioactive oh. yuck. I'm going to die. Okay, where's that ship? It should be directly above me. Oh, yes. Yeah. Directly above me. Oh, Quick. Damaged. What? No. No, 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 no. I was... Uh-oh, I'm in real bad shape. This is... This is bad. Uh, I need permission to dock. Get me onto that ship. All damaged. I, I give over. I should be able to get onto that ship. Come on. Let me in. Oh, she's gonna, she's gonna kill me. She's gonna kill me. That's what she's gonna do. Ah, this is why I don't like this particular mission because it is horrendous. Uh, let's. Uh, where's our ship? Uh, personal fighter. Let's teleport back to the personal fighter because this isn't working. Uh, I'm going to read the instructions again. All damaged. No, 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 it's not. I'm fine. I'm back in my ship. Everything's okay. <laughs> Hello there. All right. Let's consider this, shall we? Why hasn't she turned... I mean, she could turn command over to me. That would be uh, helpful, wouldn't it? Because then I'd actually be able to... Oh, I can't, I can't, like get to that ship now because my ship's in the way wonderful okay uh <laughs> that's gonna be useful get out of that please uh yes good right okay uh, how Danger. am i supposed to deal Hazardous with you region detected. yeah i know maybe i could just like push this gently out of the way of the danger Maybe, maybe, huh? Could you, could you just gently be pushed out of the way of the danger? That'd be useful, right? Then, then, then no danger, eh? Yeah, let's just gently push you out of the danger. Everything will be fine. Just enjoy being on the front of my ship. <laughs> out you go. Okay. Is this going to work? It better do. Yes. Repair! Oh, I'm supposed to repair it! Ah! Well, it could have done with telling me that. Probably did. <laughs> it most likely did. Uh, but I'm going to continue to shunt it a little bit further out of this yuck, I think. Just go. Wait, wait, wait. Okay. Right. Right then. Okay. So let's get up and see if we can do something about this Hello. now. Yeah. You're going to Already complain damaged. about the hull? All damaged. Yes. Give me a second. I'm going to repair the ship. All Maybe. Damaged. Is that me or that? What are you saying? All <laughs> damaged. Not now it isn't. I'm repairing it. Well. The hull is now 100%. Ah, what am I supposed to do? Am I supposed to claim the ship somehow? No. How am I supposed to get in the ship then? Huh? Hmm? <laughs> what does it want me to do? <sighs> okay, yeah, I, I, I did say that I would um, uh, look at the thingy. Oh dear, now there's Xenon in the area. Wonderful. Okay, let's have a look at the mission and see what it's saying. Dock at the Geometric Owl. I can't do that, it won't let me do it. <laughs> it literally won't let me do it. Okay, uh... Huh. Oh, now it will. Picky. It just wanted me to repair it first, didn't it? That was that was all it was. As soon as I repaired it, it's like, yeah, okay, you can get in now. Okay, so, let me in! Great! Is this shit mine yet? It is! Weapon, Wonderful! Pilot number three. Pilot number three? Why are all the weapons out of order? Very good. It appears you two are ready for the next field test. Hey. It's about time we sent our other ship somewhere else, isn't it? Somewhere safe. Somewhere not in the middle of the void. Because uh, the void, horrendously dangerous. Uh, okay, so... Where are we going to send it that's safe? Hmm. I suppose I could send it back to uh, back to the the uh, the uh, main place. 
Uh, go over there, dock and wait. That's brilliant, thank you. Excellent! We are ready for our mission! Come on then. Affirmative. Yeah, computer's answering. Take note of the locational information I'm about to transmit to you. Mm hmm. This ship, you see, was built for an archaeological expedition. Great. And? It will survive the radiation inside the Taurus wreckage. Uh huh. Oh! Additionally, the systems Ooh. inside are built to interface with the old Terran hardware and software. Uh huh. The modified Mark 7 computational unit will be able to extract the terraforming data that our mutual researcher friend is yearning for. Lovely. Be warned that the Terrans might not be too keen on us uh, rummaging <laughs> garbage pile. They'll be fine. <laughs> I purchased a forged ship ID, which will allow you two to reach the Taurus wreckage without questions being asked. They won't ask questions anyway. I'm like plus twenty-two and rep. Controls, that is. <laughs> It'll be fun. Download the forced idea station and deploy it directly to your ship. A oh. business partner, you see, was uh, very eager for um, anonymity. Uh huh. <laughs> right. Well, we're well on our way. I could use the autopilot, but in this ship? I mean, I was worried about using the autopilot in the other ship. Entering. System. This ship. Get so far. I do not know. All right, so we're going to a station by the looks of it, not the uh, not Taurus Wreck, because the Taurus Wreck isn't in this sector. All right, so we're picking up this uh, this device, aren't we? Hmm. Asteroids. That would have been a great test of the autopilot systems. Uh, maybe I should have used them. This ship's quite responsive. In fact, this ship's very responsive. It, it shuts down its engines pretty fast, and. It's, uh, it does the other thing pretty fast as well. Going quicker when I when I want it to. And it's got a reasonable speed on it, 500 and something. So this is this is great. This is I should get another one of these. All right. Let's dock. Okay. Nearly there. Brilliant. I wonder how the autopilot handles the docking systems. Hmm. That would have been another another good test. I will test test the docking of the the autopilot stuff. Ooh, that was close. Okay, <laughs> just press down and hope that the autopilot takes over. Uh, that's my method. Okay, so get up. We're pleased to welcome you aboard. Awaiting pilot. Oh, are we supposed to scan something? I really pilot should read instructions restricted. sometime. Off, pilot number three. No, I'm back on. Eh. Done. Great. I'm supposed to scan something. Are they now? Uh, right, okay, so I'm scanning that over there. Alright, fair enough. Let's go scan that over there. I really, as I said, I really shouldn't read read instructions. Instead of instead of just presuming I know what I'm doing, which I do quite a lot, uh, then uh, yeah, I should definitely actually read instructions. Here we go! Scanning of stuff. Tell me your secrets. Sometime. Anytime soon. Docking ah, granted. I don't want Cover docking. Activated. Cover activated. Great stuff. I'm already Terran Protectorate, though. Ah. But do not get complacent. You will still need to avoid Terran military patrols. Oh, that's interesting. The larger ships, in particular, are equipped to recognise odd signature readings and sensorage. Right, yes. There's literally no reason for me to be... <laughs> uh, let us just say that not all of the modules who are equipped with are exactly, um, legal. Oh, space. great. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Please, do reach the Taurus wreckage eventually. Ah. Uh -huh. Okay, so basically the only thing that uh, would be um, a problem for me to deal with in the Katana is the radiation from the Taurus station. So because he's saying that the this ship is equipped with stuff to deal with the radiation. So yes, 
I wonder if we can do the autopilot. Ah, this isn't terrifying at all. Okay. Uh, in that case, if we're going to go all autopilots, then we might as well go all autopilots and watch our wonderful journey through the stars uh, and and any asteroid in the way uh, with 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 this sort of um, thing where we can have a look. I love looking at the ships. It's really cool. Ugh. Be wary! There are terrible pests in this sector. Uh huh. Using autopilot. I am very wary. What? Worst case, they get you. Worst case, they start shooting. Yeah, blow me to smithereens. Yes, I know. <laughs> All right, we're going to be fine. That's my take on this. Because, as I said, we we are fine. I did. I wonder what my rep is with everybody when we're in this ship. Then, this is very interesting. Uh, we've, I mean, we've, we've, our rep's pretty good at the moment, so, ah, yes, all of our rep is completely different in, in this. Interestingly, our Alliance of the Word rep is now plus 20. Now, that's really difficult to get good rep with, <laughs> so that's really quite handy, uh, if I could, if I could actually pull it off, which I can't, but, uh, it's, it's quite handy. What's... The Talardi Company is just at zero. Everything else is sort of minus a good amount. This is totally different from our rep normally because our rep normally is quite good with most things uh, apart from uh, the Xenon and, and such like, of course. Uh, yeah, so this is this is fascinating. Have we still got the autopilot on or did I turn it off? Autopilot is activated. I am so glad it is telling me that because I definitely had no idea. All right. So how does it deal with this sort of thing? Well, it deals with them great. Transmission. Uh oh. Command, I'm getting odd readings here. No, you're not. Shouldn't Gate Patrol have reported Xenon presence? Yeah. There's and no Xenon here. No Xenon insertion past the gate. No. Everything's fine. Might be a hiccup in that old program. It no is. Sanity checks. What? Sanity checks? Uh, you're still sane. How's that? <laughs> Sanity checks? Oh, unless it's as in, uh, um, sort of purity of the device. Uh, the, uh, the, the... Mm, sanitation? I don't know. I don't know! But, uh, it's, it's, it's fine. We're, we're gonna go through here and everything's gonna be okay. But the autopilot, how, 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 bleh. The autopilot handled the accelerator really well. And this one. Ah, oh, now then. Yes. If I'd have known that it would handle the accelerator so well, then I would have probably used it far more often because handling accelerators is a pain in the neck. It really is. It's, it's not easy. Because I, I like go up to it, I stop the engine, I turn, and I usually go straight past it, and you know, it's always quite difficult to handle ex accelerators. But this way, I can do it no problem. Mm, yes, definitely. Definitely an improved version of what I do. I wonder if you can have the autopilot do this whilst you're in setter. Or is it always going to break setter to do the autopilot with the uh, with the travel engine? Huh. Probably right. Whoa. Intercepting transmission. Ugh. Why are we facing Command, this direction? Picking up signatures. Are there zero <laughs> Negative. Nah. Everything's fine. Ignore me. You're all all right. Ooh, there's a mission over there. Oh, I should probably not accept it in the uh, in this in this ship, because shooting things in this ship is probably not a good idea. I think these are mostly burst ray. Well, there's definitely two different things. I think two of them are burst ray and something as uh, something else. I've not actually checked what they've, they've got, but I'm pretty sure that last time it had burst rays. So yes, with the burst rays potentially. Unfortunately, I am all out of time. So we're going to have to continue this autopilot um, attempt in the next episode. In the meanwhile, you take care. Thanks for watching. Feel free to watch other things on my channel. Feel free to subscribe if you haven't already. See you next time. Bye now.